Welcome to this quick Linux setup guide for Transform 2020 tutorials. You'll find this and more information at this short URL right here, so perhaps pause the video and go to that, and I'll show this again at the end of the video. For now, let's open a search engine, Google or anything else you would like, and go to Anaconda Python, or you can navigate directly to anaconda.com. Let's, uh, let's go there. Once you're there, you'll want to go to products and individual editions and on Linux you'll have to download an installer and that will be for Python 3.7 so download the installer uh, for you so I would suggest this one the x86 installer while that's downloading let's go to Anaconda install on Linux so installing on Linux this, of course, will depend on which distribution you're using. So follow these instructions to install on your distribution. You'll need right here the file that we're downloading on the previous tab. Once you've installed Anaconda, let's go to a terminal and you should now see um, either base if you've already set that or you can simply conda activate base to activate that base environment. Now we're going to do a couple of things. The first one is inside of this environment, we will do a conda install of nb conda kernels. So conda is this um, package manager. We will install a package that is nb conda kernels. We'll install it inside of base. So make sure you run conda activate, activate base first. And this will allow us to then use any future environments that we create um, from base. So confirm that you want to do that. And now I'm going to create a new environment. So conda create minus minus name. Let's give this environment the name of transform 2020, for example. Choose a Python version, so Python equals 3.7, and then choose the packages we want to install in there. So for example, the whole Anaconda distribution. Confirm with yes, or simply hit in enter as the yes is the default. And we are now ready to go. We could launch our Jupyter Notebook from here and have access to Transform 2020. Now, before we do that, let's see what we might need to do if we want to install additional packages. So, for example, if you wish to install Equinor's Segway.io package, you could do that by using pip. But first, you'd have to activate the conda environment that you want to install into, so transform 2020 in this case. So let's conda activate transform 2020. And now inside of this environment, we can pip install segui.io, for example. So we have that in there. Now conda deactivate to go back to our base environment. And we will now run Jupyter Notebook from here. In here, you can then open a new notebook of the environment that you created. And so you'll see now that we can import segui.io, for example, and we have access to its methods. Okay, so with that, you're essentially ready to go. Instructors will give you uh, more specific installation details as needed. And uh, as I said, you can find this and more information at this short URL. Thank you for following, and I will see you in June.